Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are not already subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Uh, I'm gonna attempt to get more better at uploading videos every week, but it's hard. Can't make any promises. Anyways, I wanted to really quickly, and I just finished doing my hair for those who care. Um, I did a wash and go. I just took out some crochets that I had in for two weeks. And y'all, my hair was shedding like fuck. I mean, oh my God, it was shedding so bad. But that's expected. My hair always sheds really bad when I take out a protective style. I don't know. So, um, of course, I did a protein treatment tonight. And then I did a deep conditioner. And then I styled it. And it's cold outside. So, we are not going to let it air dry. And I don't have time for it to air dry tonight anyway. So, I went ahead and diffused it. And it's not as big as it will be yet. Because it's not all the way 100% dry. I just diffused it mostly dry. Um, yeah, so for those that care, I will let you guys see. Um, if you want to see how it looks from the back. I don't even know how it looks from the back, y'all. I hope it ain't fucked up. Because I'm not sure. But anyways, um, that's my hair. But anyways, back to... The product empties video so i wanted to do this really quick i'm gonna try to talk fast because i got a few products and um let you guys know what i thought of them and if i will repurchase them and how they work for my hair so i'm going to start off with some of my favorite products which is shea moisture line of things and actually no i'm not gonna start off with shea moisture's line of things because i only have three other products Two other products actually that's not even empty damn okay so i only have two other products that aren't shade make moisture so i'll talk about those first the first one is um from my curls novex this came in a curl kit i never heard of it however this little thing right here is the business for any of y'all out there that have gotten this in a curl kit and it's just still sitting in your stash you never tried it you might want to i don't know where it's at on the ground but um it smells all right and it has really good slip and it really really moisturizes my hair so i did like this product i got two uses out of this sample so and y'all can see my hair is not that thick so yeah moving right along the next one i know a lot of y'all don't heard about this this is a old school ride or die for uh in the natural world kelsey what are you doing Okay, go eat it, mama. Um, it is the Herbal Essence Hello Hydration Moisturizing Conditioner. Um, it's pretty okay. The hype for this was... It's hot, y'all. I'm sorry. I'm a little hot. The hype for this was more than I thought. Uh, I thought I was going to be wowed by this product. It was just okay, so I probably won't be purchasing it. But if you are a new natural or you're trying to find products your hair likes this is not that expensive and it is a good conditioner and the slip is pretty good too so if you want to try it then you can find this on the ground anywhere walmart walgreens every damn where i mean this is a line that you can find everywhere moving along i have the 100 percent argan oil from shea moisture i have used that up to death these oils retail for $9.99 and I use them. I love them. Um, I use the jojoba one, the argan oil one. I just bought a new one, uh, a new castor oil one because I've been getting on castor oil lately because it helps me hold more moisture in my hair during these dry ass air winter months. So yes, I would repurchase this again. And again, it's the Shea Moisture 100% Pure Argan Oil. Then I have the Shea Moisture Omega 369 Rescue and Repair Curl Defining Smoothie. Um, I use this mug up. This was my favorite styler last summer. Um, it held my hair moisture, yes. It far as far as definition, not so much. I definitely have to put a gel on top of it because it ain't really gonna define nothing. But it will moisturize your hair really good and it smells good um will i repurchase this probably not because it should it just didn't wow me that much as a styler and lately and lately i'm starting to find that i'm not so much using stylers 
if that makes sense. Like I've been more so looking at lotions and milks over um, the, the the smoothies or the pudding, the curl puddings and stuff like that. So, um, moving along, I have the Shea Moisture. The next three products are all from this line. They're all from the Mangogo and Hemp Seed Oil High Porosity Moisture Seal line. Kelsey, what are you doing? No. I'm sorry, y'all. It's my, my three-year-old. She's using the bathroom. Anyway, from the Moisture Seal line, this is the shampoo. It, it is one of my favorite shampoos. Will I repurchase this? Yes. It's one of my favorite shampoos. Like, yeah. I'm going to repurchase it. Um, it is really, it has baobab protein and apple cider vinegar in it. So it really does clean your hair really good. I really like this shampoo. I just ran out of it this past week. I mean, yeah, because I used it on my daughter's hair. So this past week, that's when I used it up. Get out, see. Get. <sighs> Y'all, <laughs> excuse me. She's over here trying to play in the toilet. Get out of there. Thank you, little ma'am. And then um, we have the High Porosity Moisture Seal Mask with Baobab Protein and Apple Cider Vinegar. It says deep condition and reveal low, mo low moisture retention, curly, coily hair. Um, this is the shit too. I will rebuy this. Um, I used the shit out of it. It's a corner right there, but it wasn't enough to do that anyway, so I just, you know, left it in there. Um, yeah. I'm going to repurchase this as well. Love it. This right here is one of my favorite deep conditioners. This is by Shea Moisture, the Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Grow Hair Mask. And it has shea butter, peppermint, and keratin in it. Um, I don't like the smell of this product. I don't like the smell of anything in this line. It fucking stinks. It smells like castor oil and Play-Doh. Which is... Oh, God. I don't like the smell of castor oil either, so I guess, you know. But anyways... The line stinks, y'all, but I will say my other favorite shampoo by Shea Moisture is in this line is the um the shampoo for this line. I love it. It cleans my hair good and it doesn't strip my hair. And it has apple cider vinegar in it as well. And my hair loves apple cider vinegar. I didn't know that, but I'm finding that out. Products that have that in it, my hair has been really good with, and I didn't really put that together until lately. But yeah, I'll repurchase this. Um, Walmart, this, I, I got this bottle from Walmart, and it's a little cheaper than getting the tubs like this, um, because this is 6 ounces versus 12, so you are getting half the size, so it is a little cheaper, um, but yeah, Walmart, if you decide you want to get this size, and it's a little cheaper, like I said, and then I just actually killed her tonight, this was, um, this is one of my favorite gels from Shea Moisture, and it is from the High Porosity line again, and it's the moisture retention, more moisture seal styling gel. I'm sorry, and it's just said it's a moisture seal styling gel. My bad. My children had a nervous breakdown. My daughter decided to eat the rest of her brother's popsicle, and he was pissed. But anyways, yeah, this right here is one of my favorite styling gels. I will definitely be repurchasing that. Um, I actually just went through my stash and realized I'm getting kind of low on things, but I'm still on a no buy because I was like, look, I buy too many products. I hoard too many products. I'm wasting my damn money because I hoard too many products. So I haven't really bought because I don't count my curl kits. So if I don't count my curl kits, then I haven't bought no products since last summer. Yeah. But anyways, let me get out of here because my child is having a meltdown in there. It's past her bedtime and I need to go handle her. So, if you guys have used any of these per usual, drop a comment below. Let me know what you thought about them, if you'll be repurchasing them. Um, and like I said, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I'm going to do my due diligence to drop at least two videos a month. That will be more... Uh, consistent than I have been being. It's just my life, y'all. It's just really hard. I'm a single mom with two kids. I work a lot. And then the little free time I do get, I try to enjoy it. So, yeah. But anyways, guys, take care. I hope you guys have a great day. And I will see you guys in my next video. Peace!